the flight control software will now compare inputs from two sensors before activating MCAS, rather than activating on a single sensor. If there is a disagreement between the sensors, MCAS will not activate. If both sensors agree and MCAS is activated, it will only activate once and pilots can override it without the software activating automatically again. And it will never override the pilot's ability to control the airplane by simply pulling back on the control column. More than 4,400 hours of testing included more than 1,350 flights.